WTFNN. Headline news update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We have the uh, Dow Industrials right now trading down 112. Most of that is Boeing. You have uh, NASDAQ up five. S&Ps are flat. Gold contract. Gold contract up $6.40 trading at 1302. We get over and we take a look at that gold contract. What you're going to see out here, folks, is that last Friday, uh, last Thursday, rather, you rejected lower price. You had lighter volume out here. And the rejection as you were coming back into the strength from January 25th. Bottom line, we're going top side again, have volume behind the move. Or 1302, I expect uh, what you're going to see out here is this run actually wants to get up into this 1356 area, which is the highs of February. So it's going to be interesting watching uh, this whole baby uh, shake out uh, and see where this can actually uh, get to and what kind of volumes we get on this move. We get over, take a look at the silver market. Silver also saved itself last week. Uh, silver is up eight tenths of one percent right now. You're trading fifteen dollars and twenty one cents. Uh, silver also rejected lower price, uh, broke its swing point. The bottom line broke its swing point on Thursday, but it came right back. So uh, silver also uh, looks like it wants to run up to the sixteen dollar and twenty uh, cent area. Notes and bonds still bottom line sideways move out here. Light volume. Uh, we rejected lower price last week. You're pulling down, you get light volume, 10 years down, uh, four ticks, 123.14. The 30 year is off 11 at 147.19. If we go over to the uh, good old King Dollar, bottom line is that uh, you have King Dollar pulling back, but guess what? Same setup, meaning tremendously light volume. Uh, we've had uh, light volume in the King Dollar as it's gone to higher price, and each and every time as it's pulled back, uh, dramatically so too. Uh, it's been trying to get to this March 7th high, which is 97.160. Uh, we got up there last week. We did 13,000, almost 14,000 contracts. Then you pull back with 12. You try to get to a high again with 10. We've done 11. So bottom line, there's not a lot of action out here. Uh, we're at 96.655. That is the December 14th high. So first off, we would have to get underneath that to get in its lower range. Uh, looks like King Dollar has, is staying in this range uh, the top of that range being the 97 number, the bottom of that range being the 94 number. Uh, bottom line, we take a look at the broad market, the S&P. You get a sideways move, you get light volume. Uh, same setup that we've uh, basically had out here in the last three or four weeks. Stay right there, folks. Next 60 minutes of trading coming up. We have the Dow Industrials right now down 114. NASDAQ up six, S&P's off one. Coming right back.